everybody, it's Heather from Cottontail Crafts. I uh, just thought I would jump on. Um, I ran to Michael's today and I got some glitter paint. And this is folk art and it's glitter, glitterific. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six. I got seven different colors of glitter paint. So I think what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to flip the camera around. I got some paper towel, I got my paint brushes, and I thought we would paint the backs of some safety eyes and have some fun. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so I thought I would just show you um, the paint that I got and this where do they have the colors written down? It's weird. I don't see the colors where they have the colors written down on here. Oh, this one is gold. This one is silver. So we got silver, we got gold, we've got red, we have well, it's a green. I don't see the color written on this one. We have a pretty green. And then we've got a blue. Aqua. It's really hard to see the names on these. Uh, this one's called Princess and it's kind of like a purpley color. And then I had to get a turquoise, of course, because that's my favorite color. So those are the colors I got. I got seven different colors. And you guys, these were like $6.99 a piece. Um, so they're not cheap. But I ordered 100 pairs of safety eyes. And I didn't order any of the circle colored discs that go with these. So I wanted to start painting um, some of these in different colors. And I've got my little vase of um, paint brushes here and I should grab my wet wipes oops so let's get making some colors okay let's do purple first and I might actually have to get a stir stick because I don't know how long these have been on the shelf for. So let me get this off and I'll be right back. Okay, so we're going to do the purple first, which is called Princess. And don't go yelling at me in the comments for not wearing gloves. I don't mind getting messy. And these have like um, protectors on them. So I'm just going to leave those on. And kind of use that as a like hold on to the eye. And I'm going to put this on fairly. Ooh, that looks like I'm going to. Okay, I gotta grab a stir stick and see if I can stir that up a little bit. Because who knows how long it's been on the. Oh, that's really thick. Wow. That's good though. That's what you want. You want thick. Because that means you won't have to do as many coats. This is going to be messy. It's all good. 
Okay, I'm going to grab like a blob of it because if I can get this on thick, then that's less coat you have to do, right? And then once this dries, I'm probably going to go back over it with a solid color, probably, probably black, I'm thinking. I think I want a little more on there than that, so let's grab some more. And I don't know how long this is going to take to dry. I have no idea. This is my first time doing this. But I think once you get the black paint on top, this, this color is going to pop out a little bit more. And I don't think I want to cover it totally because I want a little bit of like black in the background. Okay, so... I got a little bit of paint on the actual safety eyes, so I'm just going to see if I can take a wet wipe and just kind of get a little bit of that off. There. So I'm going to set that one aside. Grab another one. Actually, I'm going to. These paint brushes are old, so I am not worried about ruining these at all. I've had these paint brushes for years and years. Okay, so I'm kind of going to scrape it on and then just like dot it on. And I knew this was going to be messy. But I'm not going to do all the colors on camera with you. I'll just maybe do these purple ones in another color. And then I'll do the rest of the colors. And then I'll come back. And I'll add the black. And then I'll let them dry. And then I'll come back. And we'll do like a reveal. Because this way you can make your own safety eye colors. Which I think would be really cool. Okay, it is messy though. Not gonna lie. I just want to get a little bit of the paint off the actual back of the eye. Although it's not gonna hurt nothing. Okay, so I have a baby wipe here. I'm just gonna get most of this color off. And then I'll open another jar and I'll be right back. Okay, so I just opened up the red and it is a little bit runnier than the purple. And I don't know if that's gonna be easier to install or worse. Okay, I'm gonna try to do this where I don't get it on the post of the eye. Oh, this is gonna be so pretty. Okay, and having the protector on it, it really does help you hold on to the, the eye. I think I want a little bit more on. Ooh. 
Oops. It's messy. But we're getting um, we're getting a lot of snow today and over the weekend. Um, so a good time to play around and make your own safety eyes. Okay, because I don't want the whole thing to be covered in with the red. I want there to be some broken up spots because then when I put the black paint on top it'll it'll pop it'll really pop it'll look nice okay so I have you know applied to a couple of markets in the past couple of days and I'm not being allowed in because there are other crochet vendors. So um, not sure, like I did lots of markets last year where there was like anywhere between two and four vendors. So I guess they're cracking down on having too many of the same type of people at the, but that's not good because I haven't been able to really get into any. So I don't know what I'm going to do because I'm making all the stuff and I've got to be able to get to the markets to sell it or what's the point? So I'll just have to, and I, I, I can't apply right away because a lot of times I'm at work and I'm not allowed to have my phone on me at work. So. It's probably first come, first serve, right? But, oh, this is gonna be so pretty. So yeah, that is that is frustrating for sure. But nothing I can do about it. Okay. Okay, so now I've got purple and I've got red. I'm going to do one set in each color and I'll be back to show you a little bit of that and then I'll have to let them dry. Okay, so I got all the different colors on the eyes and I took my heat gun to it just to set it a little bit faster. Um, and now I'm going to take a little bit of um, black acrylic paint and I'm going to put a layer of black paint on top of the glitter that I just did. Come on. And hopefully it's dry enough. Hopefully. So So that's what it looks like before I add the black. Okay. And I think I'm just going to do like a, a thin layer. I don't think it has to be too thick. And it's messy, but I think it's going to be worth it. And I'm probably only going to do the one layer. So I'm going to do all these and let them dry for a little bit, and then I will be back. 
Okay, so I'm back with my painted safety eyes. Um, it's the next day, so this has dried overnight. So I'm just going to show you each of the colors again and then the um, eyes. So this is a red. And this is the eyes. It's so pretty. So then the next color is Princess, which is a purple. And that's what they look like. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a gray and purple turtle, install these eyes, and then at the end of the video I'll show you what a plushie looks like with the painted safety eyes. So I thought that would look really cool is to actually show you a plushie at the end with the painted eyes. This is the green. This is really pretty. Then we have gold. And I really think the black paint on top helps make your eyes pop. This is the silver. And most of the paint that I got is very um, big glitter. Um, this next color, I think it's the only fine one I bought out of all of them. Um, and I kind of like how they turned out too. So I might have to get some more of the fine glitter in some different colors because I do like how they turned out. And this one is the blue. This one's aqua. And hopefully this is picking up okay on my phone. I find video and pictures don't really do it justice, like in person it's really, really, really pretty. So I got seven colors, I did a sample of each color, so I will uh, go off camera and make a turtle, and then I'll come back with that plushie done for you all. We'll see you in a bit. Okay, I'm back and I made my turtle. Look at his pretty eyes. Oh my gosh, I love these. Love, 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 love him. So, that's what your plushies will look like with the painted safety eyes. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to throw this um, video up for you all. Um, there's other ways to decorate your own um, plain safety eyes so they're just they're clear and I ordered these without the colored discs um, I also I also have resin and mica powders and plain glitter so I might play around at another time with some glitter and resins if I do I will make another video for you guys um, but this one was just using the glitter paint and I got this from Michaels. So that will be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, please like, subscribe. I'd love to have you follow me. Have a great day everybody. Bye.